Just like water, conflict is something that moves through our lives, either creating beauty and innovation or causing damage and heartache. And because the cost of conflict is often difficult to get a handle on, I am going to take you on a short journey of how conflict acts like water. This beautiful mountain river is a great example of natural or what I call innovative conflict. It is both energetic and peaceful, moving, creating, shaping. Remember the last time you were near a river? How did you feel? I am Karen Valencic, founder of Spiral Impact, and through these slides, I am going to use water as a metaphor. Brace your eyes. This photo is of a slow leaking pipe found hidden in building structure, out of plain sight, distant and quiet. In our lives, this might represent those gut feelings or complaints from people we think aren't so important. Left unattended, bam, small drips usually create big issues. Then there's the not so distant drip, the faucet drip. It's annoying, but it's easy to ignore when there's a lot of other noise around. I correlate this with rude behavior in the workplace. There have been studies that show that 90% of people experience rude behavior in their workplace and half of those at least once a week. You may think, so what? Maybe people need to be thicker skinned. Yet, there is a rippling impact. And what is the cost of that ripple? Well, 63% lose work time avoiding their offender. 48% decrease their work effort. 25% admitted taking frustration out on customers. 80% lose work time worrying about it. And 12% will leave. This doesn't include the cost for potential safety issues and lack of problem solving and probably workplace illness. The costs are huge and the ripples go out in a huge way without leadership often even knowing. And then we have the reoccurring puddle. Those things that keep happening over and over and we have to keep mopping up. It's been estimated that senior management can spend 70% of their time in conflict-related issues, including labor issues, litigation, often over things that could have been prevented from the past. Then, the data is all over the map, but, the t but indicate the typical manager spends anywhere between 18 to 40% of his time in workplace conflict. What about your managers, or what about you? This is time lost toward productive outcomes straight off the bottom line. Doesn't it make sense to make mastering conflict a top priority? And then we have clogged pipes. Even minor rude behavior impacts problem solving. To bring out the best in your people, teach them how to innovate through conflict as a group. And then frozen water. What does a client or customer cost you? Don't freeze them out. There's a study where bank customers witnessed rude behavior between employees. And a whopping 80% said they would not come back. All these examples correlate with conflict. This burst pipe represents those things that could have been prevented earlier at the drip phase and now can't be ignored. Money right down the drain. Litigation, recalls, public relations, brand management, turnover can cost into the hundreds of thousands, if not millions of dollars. So now, the million dollar question. How do you get back here to this river? How do you innovate with conflict? Well, the good news, it's a learnable skill. This is another water photo which correlates to natural or innovative conflict, an ocean wave. And like the river, it is both energetic and peaceful, moving, shaping, and creating. It is a spiral. We've explored why mastering conflict is an essential skill. Spiral impact is a powerful tool to learn how to do this. So save yourself a lot of energy, time, and money by addressing those distant drips before they become massive expenses. 
master conflict, and have some fun in the process. We've explored the why, now explore the what and the how. Contact me, I'd love to help you. Call, email me now, or visit my website to sign up for updates. I look forward to possibly sharing this journey with you.